We present a receding horizon planning architecture for UAVs in unknown urban environments that enables fast replanning necessary for reactive obstacle avoidance. We achieve this by efficient spatial partitioning data structures to reason about geometry in real time, dynamic velocity planning according to obstacle density, and a receding horizon minimum jerk trajectory generator to enable smooth, robust, and high speed flight. The mission task is to visit predefined waypoints 1, 2, and 3 and return to the start location. The task is performed in a fully unknown and GPS denied urban environment. The UAV is equipped with an IMU and an Intel RealSense RGBD camera. After takeoff, the Quadrota flies with a top speed of 7 meters per second to waypoint 1. The direct way between waypoint 1 and 2 is blocked by several buildings. Therefore, the Quadrota has to find a path through a narrow alleyway. Close to obstacles, the Quadrota automatically reduces its velocity while increasing as soon as it reaches an open area. The algorithm consists of five steps. Compute a rolling buffer multi-layer map. Find sparsified global 3D path to the goal. Select local receding horizon goal along the global path. Compute a set of dynamically feasible continuous and smooth motion primitives. Select motion primitive with minimum cost. The multi-layer map has a resolution of 0.5 meter with a dimension of 60 times 60 times 6 meter. The first layer contains the probabilistic fused history of the depth sensor measurements. A second layer contains the nearest obstacle in a defined distance for each voxel. The global planner runs a breadth first search on a weighted sum of the map layers and a target altitude to the global goal at 2 Hz. The global path is sparsified and used to generate a local goal. See the brown sphere. A set of 270 minimum jerk motion primitives, see the white dots, is computed covering a large spatial and dynamical space. The primitives are cost evaluated depending on collisions in the map and the current depth image, proximity to obstacles and to the local and final goal. The motion primitive with the smallest cost is tracked. The full motion primitive set is updated every 33 milliseconds. See the green lines. As soon as the UAV leaves the tight alleyway, it accelerates again to the starting location.